Ooh, ain't nothing like a fresh car after you don't wash it yourself. Period. Let's hope it doesn't rain now because the last time I washed my car, it rained like um, the next day or the other day after. Later that same evening. Y'all see what I'm talking about with Atlanta? on my way to Walmart I swear to y'all that Walmart is like my second home um yeah so I'm up in that bitch like every day so I have some stuff that I have to get um I think I'm gonna wash my car today because she is due for a washing and in the summertime I can't have my car looking a mess so I think I'm gonna just give her a wash like every week like probably on a Sunday today's a Sunday by the way and I feel like Sundays are kind of like for car washes and stuff like that or cleaning or whatever so I'm going to give her a wash today and I have some other stuff I need to do also um <clears throat> yeah so listen oh let me tell you guys this again um even though y'all probably heard me say that a million times the baddie sauce is on sale right now 20 percent off for the rest of june for pride month use the code pride to get 20 percent off your baddie sauce go and shop right now you better hurry up. yes so uh, who texted me um, so yeah, make sure y'all go and get your baddie sauce. Guys, it is hot as hell in Atlanta today. It is hot, honey. Oh. So y'all, um, remember in the last video, I was trying to find somewhere where I can get, um, I was trying to find like a nose ring at the mall or whatever, and I wasn't able to find any. And y'all suggested that I try, um, Claire's. So, I don't think I'm going to go to the mall today, but I am going to probably go tomorrow because I noticed that the mall, today's a Sunday, I know the mall going to be packed as hell. So, I'm probably going to go tomorrow. Yeah. And I also need to go to this place. I've been trying to find um, something to use for my hair because as y'all know i'm kind of losing my hair at the top right there so i need to find some kind of product that i can use to um get my hair together and um i found this place i was going to order it online but i decided that no i am going to go to the actual place because they actually have a location here in atlanta so i'm going to go to the actual place and go and get the, the the right product for my hair so my hair can start growing back girl because it looks a mess okay and it's been um fading over the years and baby you're fading you're fading away and no ma'am no I gotta fix that so yeah i am going to go um i was going to go today but they're not open on a sunday so i'm gonna have to go another time probably tomorrow i'm gonna probably go tomorrow so yeah so today's my off day from the gym i didn't go to the gym today i normally take like most of the time i take sunday off but i i actually took yesterday off also because i don't know when friday came my body just like felt really really tired so i decided to take two days off to rest up but when i tell you i'm gonna be up in that gym tomorrow don't play with me i've been going religiously and i really like where i'm at right now because i feel like i'm actually getting somewhere because in the past i just felt like i wasn't getting anywhere and you know how that feel when you're working out and you just feel like you're not you're not getting anywhere like you just feel like you're working out for no reason you're not seeing no results and 
you get discouraged so now that I'm looking in the mirror and I'm actually seeing like my face slimming down my neck looking slimmer and I just feel smaller in my clothes now I feel like more confident to make sure that I am um, working out so yeah and you know what was stopping me from losing weight also so I, I was I was taking this thing to help my hair grow called keeps I'm gonna call y'all out and it was actually it was not helping because I was having side effects like I was I was actually having erectile problems I was actually having erectile problems oh my gosh yes girl I was having erectile problems I'm like what the hell and I didn't know that it was because of that why I was having that at first and when I googled it I found out that yes that's the reason why that's one of the side effects that people complain about they can't get an erection and I'm like oh hell no so after researching that I decided you know what I'm gonna get off this product also it was also it was also making me gain weight instead of lose weight so I was going to the gym and I wasn't losing weight at all and I was wondering what the hell is happening is this damn product um keeps so I was taking the pills and they had um this thing that you rub in your hair this foam thing and it also had the oil thing that you put on your scalp so I was taking all three of them and I don't I don't know if it was working but it took like a it, t it take like months to get in your system so I did notice that um, I was having a little bit of problem like getting erect and stuff like that but I didn't know that this is too much information by the way yep I didn't know that it was as a result of this product that I was taking and I was like oh no even though I don't have sex a lot I was like oh no I have to stop taking this product no ma'am no ma'am I can't be taking this product and I'll be mal malfunctioning no ma'am I'm gonna have to just be a bald-headed bitch because no ma'am <laughs> no so I stopped taking it and I basically wasted my money because yeah I, st I still have products from them that I'm not taking um, oh yeah I think they had given me a shampoo too a shampoo and a conditioner that you use in the shower I stopped using um, I feel like this is um, kind of not straight and I have y'all here kind of twisted girl there y'all go I think that's a little bit straighter let me fix up myself I'm about to go in Walmart so yeah I basically wasted my money because I was using that product and yeah it was just it wasn't working well I don't know if it was working because I don't think I was using it long enough but I think I was using the product for like three months that's a long time to be having like stuff like that in your system so yeah so I had to stop taking it and yeah it was just a mess it was really just a mess so yeah I'm finna run into Walmart. So, the, so uh, girl, I'm all over the place. So, the place that I'm telling y'all about is called, let me tell y'all. I have bought something from them before. But I think, um, I don't remember if I used it. Did I use it? So, the place is called, let me tell y'all. Hold up, hold up. I hope the, um, the AC is not too loud in the video. Um, it's called... Tropic, it's called Tropic something. Um, it's called Tropic Isle Living, and I think it's a Jamaican company, but they have a location here in Atlanta. So I'm definitely gonna go check them out to try to get the Jamaica. I think they have the Jamaican castor oil. I think I did buy this in the um, I think I did buy this before. I don't remember. I'm all over the place today, girl. So yes i am going to get that and try it and i'm going to actually go to the place and see what other products they have probably something that smell good because i think it, when i had bought it before i didn't like the smell of it so yeah so let me run into walmart real quick and i will be right back y'all so i really came here to get something to wash nisi because she's really dirty and i'm gonna wash her so i really just came to get some car soap but i ended up buying some other stuff 
um mind your business i'm probably gonna put that back <laughs> but yeah i needed to get some peppers and some snacks and some wipes and some, some deodorants and some um digest digestion shots so yeah so i'm trying to figure out which soap i want though do i want this or should i get something else um i'll let y'all know what i end up getting we interrupt this program to bring you a special report And now back to your regularly scheduled program. Also, I'm back in the car. Well, let me sanitize real quick, girl. I got a little thing that I get from um, Bath and Body Works. It's a hand sanitizer, but it's like a spray. So it's kind of scented. And of course, you know, it's in um, champagne toast. So I really love using that. Ooh. Y'all, let me ask y'all a question. Where do y'all shop? Do y'all prefer Walmart or Target? So I'm at Target right now. I just left Walmart and I'm at Target. And I feel like tar um, Walmart is always packed. And their stuff is always like running out because a lot of people shop at Walmart. I feel like every time I go to Target, I mean, you see a good amount of people, but it's not like too much. So I feel like more people shop at Walmart. Comment down below and let me know. Um, I like both, but sometimes Walmart be doing a lot. So sometimes I like to come to Target. And if I go to Walmart and I don't get, I always go to Walmart first. If I go there and I don't get something that I want, then I, I check Target. So, um, let me see, let me see. Where is my thing here? I'm trying to find my, my shot, to take my shot. So y'all, I have been very consistent with my shots. Ever since um, COVID, I have been make sure that I, I take my shots. And I feel like it definitely helps. So today I'm gonna be taking the digestion one. So this one just having like the, the ginger, the raw ginger and the, I think it has pineapple in there also. Um, this one doesn't have the, what you call, what you might call it? What's that thing, the other thing? Um, damn it. I can't remember right now. But the one the one that I normally take, it has um something else in there. Ginger and let me tell y'all. Hold up. Hold up. Ginger and ginger and turmeric. Turmeric. Wow. Yeah, so the one I normally take has the ginger and turmeric in it. This one is just ginger and it helps with your digestion, so I love to take it. And I feel like it gives me a little bit of energy. So I'm gonna shake it really well. Really, really well, girl. When I tell you outside is hot, it is really hot. <sighs> Cheers. Ah. Girl, they always give you that kick, girl, that you need. All right, let's go. Y'all are my little roadies for today. Let's go. Let's get out of here now. We gotta be careful. Uh, uh, uh. Listen, I'm so grateful for y'all. I am almost at 9K. Remember that when I get to 10K, I am going to be doing a giveaway period but yeah um shout out to you guys i really appreciate you guys and all the support i am really appreciative of you guys thank you guys so so much and i'm going to try my best to give you guys what you need not what you want but what you need on life of carrie period 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 so yeah, what am I finna do now? I don't even know. Yeah, I just have to watch to see. 
but yeah it is um 89 degrees so you could just almost say it's 90 degrees girl and yeah so y'all i'm gonna go back a little bit to what i was saying about um the weight thing i know i talk about weight a lot but i feel like i don't know i've always had this this ongoing struggle with weight like my weight always go back and forth and back and forth and if you've been watching us um over the years you would have known that i was big my whole life like um in high school and all of that i used to get bullied and stuff like that and um in 2000 and i would say 12 i started like dieting and working out really really um a lot and i lost 60 pounds and i was looking bomb as hell i had a nice ass body abs all of that girl muscles or whatever and then i kept off the weight for like say five or six years or something like that and then when um karanda came and the gym was closed down and i stopped working out i started eating a lot and i gained back the weight and i started doing mukbangs and the mukbangs did kind of aid with me um gaining weight to be honest but now i feel like i'm at a place where i am taking control i'm taking back my time i'm taking control and i am saying no carrie you need to do this for yourself take your time and do it and you can definitely do it so that's what i'm doing right now so if you feel like you are in a spot where you're stuck and you feel like you're not getting anywhere just keep going keep going and eventually you will get where you need to be okay period the next day so y'all i'm on my daily walk and i stopped by chick-fil-a to get me a salad i got me the cob salad but i changed out the you know they normally give you like the um the fried chicken nuggets I got the green one instead. I try my best to um, eat healthy when we're not filming. Because I really feel like you guys don't want to see the healthy stuff. Y'all love seeing the fried stuff and the bread and the pasta and the rice. So when I'm not filming, I re I'm really trying to friggin' eat better when I'm, I'm on my off days. Even though I do be cheating because... So I want to tell you the struggle is real, but I'm about to kill this salad. I love Chick-fil-A salads. They're, I love their service. Their service is really good. And yeah, um, I'm about to wrap up my walk after the gym. And I must say, I had a really good walk. I ran a really, really good workout today. I'm so proud of myself. Uh, not me. Um, not y'all talking to the salad girl. <laughs> Care Bears, when I tell y'all this is about to be a crime scene, y'all don't even know how hungry I am. I haven't at all day. It's like 8 o'clock now, 8 p.m. When I tell you this is about to be a crime scene, yellow tea <sighs> A few moments later. I did not come here to play with you hoes. No, ma'am. What did I tell y'all? Crime scene, yellow tip. Wrap it up. <laughs> so I have all the water in the world and I'm ready to give Nishi, Nisi, Nishi, I'm ready to give Nisi a quick wash. And yeah, so I'm ready. So I ended up getting this soap to wash my car. I don't know if it's gonna be any good, but it was purple. You know, purple is my favorite color. Let's see what she's about to give. So I'll check back in with y'all when I'm done. And um, I'll let y'all know. Yeah, so I'm finally done. And this soap actually did a really good job. I like this soap. So I'm definitely gonna be using that again. Not as if I, I had a choice because I, I bought a big bottle, but it really did a really good job. I like it. My car looks spanking brand new. I didn't have to do too much to the inside because the inside was basically clean. But now the outside is spanking new. Ooh. 
Ain't nothing like a fresh car after you don't wash it yourself. Period. Let's hope it doesn't rain now because the last time I washed my car, it rained like um, the next day or the other day after. Ain't nobody got time for that. But Nisi loves me, period. Later that same evening. Y'all see what I'm talking about with Atlanta? It will be sunny and hot one day, then the next day is thunderstorms, girl. Look like we are about to have a hurricane out here. Look at this. No, ma'am. What the hell is this? Let me close this door. Because she is doing the most, honey. No, ma'am. You earned 20 points. Y'all, it's the finale, y'all. Y'all. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. 40, bringing you to a oh my god, y'all, my favorite, my favorite one, y'all, juicy one! <laughs> yes! <laughs> y'all, y'all, my favorite team won, legendary. Are you dumb? I knew they were gonna win. They're the best. They are the best. Oh my god! Yes, girl! Yes, Brooklyn! Come on! Yes! <laughs> the girls are carrying. Yes! Come on. The best team. Okay, guys, so this is the end of the video. I know this video is not long as my usual vlogs, and I apologize to you guys for that, but you're getting a new, a next video, another video, I should say, before the end of the week, probably on Friday. So make sure you look out for that. And I love you guys so, so much. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure if you're watching and you're still not subscribed, subscribe, please, like this video. And leave a comment down below. I'm not playing with you. I love my Care Bear so, so much. We're on our way to 10K. Are you dumb -ay? <laughs> I love you guys so, so much. And I'll see you in the next video.